Hello, this is Kurt Brown, alias St. Rambon, most recently an investigative journalist on finance and, and medicine crimes and the governments of the United States. I was also part of that, a federal bank examiner, basically an auditor of banks at the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation. A greater concern to me other than murders inside the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation where I was put to work. I did not know there had been a murder there. I would not have worked there. I ended up being blacklisted from all federal employment because of my observations and comments. And not my not being part of that race that is that syndicate in San Francisco. I don't see him as part of the human race, to be honest, but that's my own opinion after working there. I want to talk to you about forced medical procedures in Los Angeles at the Veterans Administration Hospital in Westwood. I was uh, basically forced medical procedures there and tortured in 2001, and they were ordered to stop all those forced medical procedures in 1999. The same Veterans Administration Hospital with pushing from the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation and also the syndicates that control the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation in San Francisco, primarily I would say the Asian and Mexican and likely the, some out of uh, Canada and Europe of course. They ended up having me pushed out completely and another man killed and they were pushing a lot of people out, good employees, keeping those they could keep tucked away. A greater concern to me is Los Angeles, where I was forced medical procedures, though. I had a dream last night, Sweet Carol, Sweet Carol being the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation Board of Directors, U.S. Treasury, and the Treasury Chairman, all of you, Sweet Carol. I had a dream. A man came to me and said, if you knew what they did to you, you would know what they did to me. He went to run away. But he got knocked down because they had done some work on the central nervous system. Can they override your central nervous system? Interlay something in? Take part control? Have little fingers dangling off the side perhaps for them to pull and snatch you down with? These are some things you think about if you ever trained in medicine and finance at that level. California is a prison state, boys and girls. If you're from the Gulf Coast, stay out of it. Finance is not as good as it used to be. People are killing each other out here. It's not worth it. I thought about something the other day. I had a uncle of sorts who was shot in the back of his head one day when he was running a business, a legitimate business, a taxi cab. Now that was significant to my family as seeing, I guess, JFK would have felt with his family members being shot. Or maybe it was JFK who was shot point being it all feels the same when I'm held down and tortured if I see someone in my family held down and tortured it upsets me greatly but what can you do about it the best you can do is stay away from the source I now urge young people not to come to California but to view it as a place where they allow forced medical procedures at the Veterans Administration Hospital in Westwood in Los Angeles beware of the entire state there's no telling what they're doing to us including the Gulf Coast which is in that wretched area of New Orleans where you ain't nothing till you're dead. You're nothing anyway, most of, most of you in that region. Look at the price of your property. This is Kurt Brown, alias St. Rambo on Mobile Audit Club saying, protect your own, you're on your own. They don't own you, they'll sell you.